guys welcome back to my channel and if you're visiting for the very first time my name is Zara so guys in today's vlog we're going to be talking about beauty yes you heard me right I'm gonna be sharing some DIY natural beauty remedies slash recipes with all of you guys <laughs> This vlog is not only for the women, it's also for the guys because we're going to be tackling under eye dark circles and uh, skin pigmentation. And this is a problem that not only women face, but men also face it. And the remedies that I'll be sharing with all of you are remedies that can be tried out by both men and women. And these are things, uh, products that I actually use on my skin. I have tried and tested them and only after being 110% convinced have I decided to make this vlog. And the best thing is that the ingredients that are required for these remedies slash recipes are available in our kitchen. So firstly, let's start by me telling you what my problem areas are uh, as far as my skin or my face is concerned. Over the last few months, I've noticed that my under eyes have all of a sudden just started darkening up. You know, I first noticed this when I was in Greece. And at the time, I remember thinking that, okay, maybe it's because I'm jet lagged or we've been on the go nonstop traveling. So I didn't really pay much attention to it, thinking that, oh, once I get back to my normal, regular routine, things will be better. But no, I got back to India, things got regular. But dark circles, they just did not go away. So naturally, the first thing I did was I called up my doctor, went and saw my doctor and said, you know, I've got these dark circles and I don't know where they've come from. So he actually sent me in for some blood work and uh, it came back that my vitamin D levels were very low. So then he put me on vitamin D capsules, tablets, and I took that for about three months. And then I thought that the dark circles are not going away. Dark circles is something that I have never ever had in my life. And if you remember a little while back, I had done a vlog on my five minute makeup routine. And even in that vlog, I had mentioned that I don't use concealer, under eye concealer, because I, I, I feel if I don't need it, why use it, right? But now, these last few months, I've noticed that concealer is the one thing that I'm using the most. So after the vitamin D didn't work, I went and saw my dermatologist and I said, I'm having these issues with my um, under eyes. And uh, he, of course, went ahead and said that, uh, you know, we can try this injection or this treatment or this chemical peel. So I don't know, I'm just not too comfortable with any kind of invasive uh, treatment on my face. So I said, okay, let me think about it. And I was just thinking about it when this lockdown happened. Okay, so I was like, okay, there goes. So now what? So then what happened is I had like some really expensive eye creams uh, just lying around at home and I thought, okay, I'll try these out. Uh, tried it out for two, two and a half months, nothing. Yes, um, smoothened out the skin, but the dark circles were still there. So after everything failed, finally and I remembered something from, I think when I was like 13 years old. So I had this friend whose mother had amazing skin and this lady would say, I use no makeup, I use no creams bought from stores, nothing at all. All she ever used was potato starch. And of course, at that time, I didn't pay much attention to it, but now it totally made sense to me. So I went online, started doing my research and I came up with this concoction. I have come up with two creams that I've been using for the last two weeks and I have seen amazing results, guys. That's why I decided today that I'm gonna share this DIY recipe with you guys. So yeah, two recipes, one cream for the eyes and one cream for the entire face. So without wasting time, let's quickly get started. Aye. For our miracle eye jelly, we will be needing only three ingredients. Yes, you heard me right. We will firstly be needing potato starch, one high caffeine tea bag, and half a cup of hot water. Firstly, take a half cup of water and warm it up. Bring it to a boil. After that, add the tea bag to the hot water and let it steep for five minutes. 
Now put a pan on the stove on medium heat and add one tablespoon of potato starch. Now add the hot tea water to this. Give it a good stir and keep stirring. The mixture might get a little lumpy, but that's okay. Keep stirring. When you see that bubbles have formed in the mixture, then turn off the stove. Stir the mixture and let it cool down. Once it's cool, transfer the mixture to an airtight glass jar. And there you go. That's your miracle eye jelly. Okay guys, so let's get started. Makeup is off, hair is tied up. Yes, make sure your hair is tied up because this substance is quite sticky. You don't want to get it into your hair. And I just want to make a note here, like I mentioned before, even guys can use this. Okay guys, don't feel disheartened. No, I would never do that. This cream here is for everybody, men and women, whoever out there is suffering from dark circles can use this cream and lighten their dark circles. So let's start We're going to open this jar. I have it in airtight container. Mein rakha hua hai. Okay, and now we're going to take out a little bit of the substance of our gel, our miracle eye cream, and we are going to apply it right under the eyes, okay, where you feel your skin is darkening and you need to lighten it up. So let's do it. got some really powerful natural components here in this cream. Aisa kuch nahi hai that there's uh, chemicals in here or any anything harsh, any harsh substance, nothing like that. It's all natural. But I would still recommend that if you have sensitive skin, do a patch test. Okay? Apne haath pe ya kahin pe laga ke isko test kar lijiyega. Wait a few hours and see how your skin reacts to it. And if you feel any itchiness or redness or anything like that, then please do not use this, okay? Because at the end of the day, I'm not an expert. I'm not like a beauty consultant or, you know, whatever cosmetic giant, <laughs> whatever you want to call it. I'm just a regular normal little girl who is trying natural remedies at home. So, okay, now that we have this on, we are going to wait for fifth. 15 minutes okay so 15 minutes you can do whatever you want you work around the house you know whatever needs to be done and uh, yeah just wait patiently 15 minute ke baad, we will be gently gently taking this off so while i'm waiting i'm gonna have a cup of tea and i'm gonna read a little bit up now and now I'm going to show you how to remove this gel cream from underneath your eyes okay if you're lucky enough and you got the exact right uh, consistency of this gel cream then you will probably be lucky enough to just peel it off okay I am never really able to get the right consistency uh, so what I normally do is I just take some makeup pads like the ones I have here just regular normal cotton makeup remover pads get some warm water okay I have that here as well okay dip it in some warm water and just lightly rub it off okay so we're gonna do that now I'm gonna show you how that's done It is a little time consuming guys, but it's definitely worth it, okay? Point here is to get off as much as you can, okay? And then we're gonna go wash our face off, okay? So gentle, 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 that is the key. I'm sure you can see the brightening effect under my eyes now, eh? Okay, I got off as much as I could and I'm gonna quickly go and wash my face, okay? So, I'm gonna rub off the last little residue here that I've got. I'm just gonna quickly run to the washroom and wash my face. I'll be right back. Okay guys, so I am back. And now take a look at my eyes, at my under eyes. 
okay do you not see the difference not only does it feel tighter like my under eyes feel um, nice and firm and I can visibly see the difference and now moving on to the second step of our make your skin glow naturally beauty routine okay so we targeted the under eyes first thing okay and now we're gonna target the entire face because um I don't know about you guys but it happens to me if I'm a little stressed out or if I've just been out and about in the Sun you know I tend to lose my glow and um, my glow is something that's very important to me and I think nice glowing skin is something that everybody is entitled to all of us deserve to glow so now let's go make our special miracle cream that is going to make your skin glow. Jillian. For our miracle face cream, we will be needing only three ingredients. First and foremost, our most magical ingredient, which is potato starch, followed by three teaspoons of aloe vera gel. The third ingredient is vitamin E oil or almond oil or olive oil or any oil of your preference. But you would only use this if you suffer from very dry skin. So now let's get started. Take one teaspoon of potato starch and put it in a bowl. Add three teaspoons of aloe vera gel to this and give it a good mix. Keep mixing. And now comes the optional step. If you suffer from dry skin, then add two to three drops of oil to this mixture and mix it. And ta-da, you're done. Here is your miracle face cream. You can keep this mixture in a cool room for up to three days. If you wish to keep it for longer, then you can keep it in the fridge for up to seven days. So I have the cream here now, and now I'm going to apply this to my skin. So guys, this cream here is really a miracle cream, okay? Because I've been using it for a week now, and I see the difference in my skin. All my blemishes have lightened up. So you just want to rub this into your skin gently. Apply it all over your face. Excuse the bam bam guys. We're supposed to be in partial lockdown. They can bam 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 bam. Then bhar chalta hai. Oh well. Okay, so now that I've got the cream on my face, I'm going to leave it on for the entire day. And that's because today I have nowhere to go. Hamara lockdown ho rakha hai. So I'll be home all day. So I'll keep the cream on all day and let it work its magic. So ye jo potato starch hai is cream mein, that is the magic ingredient of the cream. The potato starch helps in lightening our blemishes and uneven skin tone ko ye even karta hai and also i'm sure once you have it all you'll feel that it's tightening your skin so your pores also tighten up overall it's just very good for your skin so yes like i said keep it on all day if you have nowhere to go and um if you do if you're busy during the day you're out and about and you don't want to go around with this cream on because what i've noticed is once it dries up sometimes it leaves a little white residue so yes if you've noticed that the cream is leaving a little white residue then don't be worried that's normal it's natural that's a potato starch and even though it's dried it's still working it's still working on tightening those pores tightening that skin and brightening up your complexion if you are a working woman or working man then uh, you can apply this once you get home from work in the evening and just keep it on overnight so guys this was it this was my two-part make your skin glow naturally beauty routine do try it out and let me know how it works for you guys it has worked wonders for me and i hope it works the same for all of you uh, but do keep in mind i want to emphasize on this once again uh, please do a patch test if you have sensitive skin so yes this concludes my vlog for today i hope you all enjoyed it and please do leave comments in the comment section below and let me know how these creams worked for your skin hey guys i I thought before I end the vlog, I should uh, take Saurabh's review. So Saurabh, what would you like to say about my eye patch uh, gel? You and I also tried it uh, because usually I have some retention problem and you know, puffy eyes, especially early in the morning and it works wonders. Matlab, uh, I have never seen something so effective, so easy to make and amazing. And Saurabh, other than a, jo bhi nahi cheez market pe aati hai, he likes to buy it. 
he'll buy everything and try it and try it and try it. But this one, I mean, normally doesn't actually see results. But in this instant result, and I was quite surprised. Yeah, especially her that face pack cream. I'm mm -hmm. yet to try that, and Zara has been using that face pack cream for over a week, and I must say it's amazing. You know, her skin feels so rejuvenated, refreshed. Uh, I think I think both the product you guys should make try it by yourself and let us know how you find it. Well, thank you so much for your review, Mr. Pandey. You're I welcome, really madam. appreciate it. You're welcome. And I thought you have to make a guest appearance in every vlog of SAV. So. Yes. So no uh, vlog is uh, complete. complete without me and I'm not complete without her. So yeah. And we're not obvious. complete without you guys. Yes. So, so take care, like, share and subscribe. See you again next time. Bye. Bye.